I'm good. I'm good. They're starting. So, player one versus player two. Furno's got the May. Mankind knew that they can Get out of here, Sova. <laughs> Ooh, we have some we have some flame bait going on in the chat. Who's better? Who's better? <laughs> this is the beginning of top eight, nostalgic casual. So it's not even not even close to the grand final. We still have a lot more action left. For you. Yeah, I've heard that too, Egalitarian. I've heard that before. That chip needs buffs. Have y'all heard this before? They're lying to you. Just so you know, they're lying to you. He does not eat buffs. <laughs> Alright. Eno versus May. The matchup is scary for Eno. I'm not saying that it, it favors May straight up, but I will say that May can make mistakes. Eno cannot. That's the matchup. Good answer. Good command grab. Wow. It has a lot of range, shot. I'm learning this today. It has more range than I thought it did. That is a wall break. Almost up. Mix. Ooh, what was that dash overhead mix? That was interesting. Side switch from Furno. Totsugeki into the 6 heavy. Look at the damage. Purple can- Ooh, slow motion is cheap in this game. Come on. Even that cheap button can be destroyed by slow motion. Look at that. Count. Wow. They're answering each other splendidly, but Diaphone is using their more evasive buttons. A lot of down S, a lot of down dust, things like that to try to go underneath what Furno's doing and be evasive on the Dolphin Cancers. 6 H into stroke, into a free mix, another stroke. Using the plus frames effectively. Really excellent mix ups. Not enough. Wow, and that is enough for the wall. Hey, so chat, who knows Eno? Teach me. When he does chemical love like that in a wall combo, it's untechable? Is chemical love always untechable? Is that how it works? They can never attack there? Wow, that's pretty nice. So you can get at the wall, you can get chemical love, and then you can get six heavy after the way that Diaphine is doing. Yeah, we're good. Game number two coming up. All right, game two. Totsugeki, trade it. Oh, but the jump back heavy slash. Counter. See what I mean about the 2S being evasive? That seems to be a good answer for the full screen, the Totsugeki's. Uh, but I don't know if that would work if Furno would utilize them in a block stream. Perhaps that only works when Furno does them in the neutral like that. Plus, 6 heavy. That was a good burst. Oh, is that the input? Okay, thank you. So the 2H. That button's really evasive, huh? It goes under a lot of stuff, just like the, just like the stroke does, it looks like. And it also has disjointed hitbox. I see. That explains a lot. Still turned it into a mix-up. Okay, good match there by Furno. One thing that's a little tricky, but you can get used to it after a while. Whenever Eno uses the aerial dive kick, if they guess wrong on the mix-up, uh, she's pretty minus there. You don't always get a free punish, but you can usually take your turn there if you block those. In fact, it's good to try to take your turn there. Don't let her steal a turn. Suki, if anything, thank you, Suki, for joining us in the tournament tonight. I really appreciate you. Come back to the next one. I can tell that you're very strong. Your Leo was looking sick. Cool. All right. One to one is the score, everybody. <laughs> all right, all right, everybody. That's a good key. That was good. Once again, as a reminder, it's three out of five, everybody. So... It's 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 a long range game. You had one mix, by the way, Silky. Did anybody see the mix I was talking about? You had one mix that I'm really amazed that it was even blocked. You had the craziest back turn mix ups. You had some really good ones. Okay. One, two, three. Totsugeki into the six H.
Hey, I love SeaWorld too. I love the Jellyfish Pirates. Are you serious? Who knows about the Dizzy and May ending? What is that, XX or whatever? That's one of the dopest endings in, oh, of Guilty Gear history. Is Dizzy and May joining the Jellyfish Pirates together. I love that ending. Los into the 6H. And then after the stroke, you still get a, a forward heavy every time, or a dash heavy, I should say. The throw did a grip? Wow. Throws hurt in this game, chat. It's not just that they're fast, it's that they're also painful. They hurt a lot. Yeah, the, 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 the one in the orange, she has some issues in general. She's wild. 6P, very good one. That was one heck of a read. You read those, Verno? You know when the 6P? Jump heavy, mix time. Six heavy for the ender. Plus frames, yep, you have to respect. But the punch, the punch work. Go burst. This is a last chance go burst. And Totsugeki. Totsugeki. Sea World. 2 1 right now for Ferno. But again, we are in 3 out of 5 status, everybody, so it's not over. <laughs> you know, best grappler says someone. Her command throw is very strong. If I could say, if I could say probably best improvements for Eno in this version compared to the previous BOT Gear version, it's the ground super that's actually reversal now and the command grab super. That's just, just, just thumbs up. Really good improvements for Eno. She needed those. I'm not going to lie to you. The fireball is worse now, but you know, still. You know, I don't think it's ever really explained in the story why Mei is so strong. It's just accepted that she's strong. Good super. Oh, but it did Wow! That's the first time I've seen that. So if it hits too far, it won't combo? Still motion after the back dash. Still back dashing. Good block. Clutch block. It was very hard to tell what side that was on. Oh, okay, I see. So that's really all it is. That makes sense. Thank you, Chai. Good answer. Totsugeki, I know someone like it. They're just doing Totsugeki, but it's a good answer. That's what you gotta do. Good super. That was a counter. And good damage. Nice low mix. Back dash not good enough to get away. 6P also not good enough. Just out of range. Another 6. Oh, we're 6P in. One of these is going to work. Because I said so. 6P again. That one worked. But no meter available to extend the combo. Totsugeki RC. Totsugeki RC. That almost sounds so like one word. Yes, Sandman. The dash button macro is extremely useful. So in this game, unlike previous games, when you use a dash button macro, you don't have limitations. So you can do the lowest height air dash you want with the dash macro. Really good. You can also do back dashes with the macro and stuff, right? Counter. Mm, peppers, 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 peppers. Inferno's the one with a the burst. They might press the combo. No, they're saving it. They're saving it. Ooh, I think that was a drop. I'm not sure what the correct combo option was there. And Ferno is gonna take the set three to one, everybody. All the May lovers are cheering and going crazy. They're doing totsukekis all over the world right now as we speak. Ooh, chat, chat. Sea World is dangerous. I'm teaching y'all right now. So the winner was Ferno, three to one. Props Ferno, well played. It is not over. For Diaphony, everybody. All lovers of Diaphony at home. They will be playing in the loser side of the bracket. So look forward to more of their great action with Eno. And don't forget, everybody. It's a guaranteed top 8 payout tonight. So if you want to help out the players and support them, there's two big ways to help. Number one is check out that match reno page right now, everybody. Where there's over $1,300 for the players. That's godlike. We have no more free codes because you use them all.
Thank you, everybody. But we still have lots of ways to support here on the sidebar of the page. Check it all out. You have Twitter quests on there that are free, Twitch quests, YouTube quests, and they involve sometimes following some of your favorite players that you want to follow anyway. You can also buy a shirt in the store, or you can donate directly to help the players. And last but not least, you can also help out by subscribing to Team Spooky. Thanks to all of you. We gave 400 plus dollars to the prize pool to help the homies out, courtesy of you all at home. So help us out with a sub, a gift sub, a prime sub. They all help us continue to do what they do, and it also adds to the prize pool as well. Thanks, everybody. Also, Totsugeki is life, like that one gentleman said. It's true. So next prediction, everybody. So the next match is, if I have it right, let me look at that top eight bracket one more time. The next match is Kizzy versus Pink. Oh, man, snap. These matches are getting crazy now. Cool. I'm, I'm ready for them to join the lobby or whatever, whenever they want to join up. Okay, no, nobody's here just yet. Sorry. I was plugging the match, you because I wanted the people to help them out and support. Thanks, everybody that's been doing it. Thanks for subscribing to us, too. So many subs tonight that it's impossible for me to keep up. Thank you, HPYNSO. Thank you, my friend. Thank you, the big elephant in the room. Thank you, Remove Widow. Thank you, Yo David O. Y'all are awesome. Thanks for all the subs, and thanks for also subbing and helping out and supporting the prize pool. So we got, coming up, who did I say? It's Kizzy versus Pink. So it's a Panda Global. Basically a Panda Global shootout. They got to face each other. But they have the three out of five, so they can really adjust to each other. Thank you, Holy Toast. He's got the Holy Toast. Watch out for the Holy Toast. That actually sounds kind of hype. Thanks for all the subs, Holy Toast. Really kind of you. They've got the Holy Toast. <laughs> Oh, man, I love it. So I think this is Pink that's here already getting set up in the lobby. So once they sit down, I'm going to spectate them and get ready. Again, it's Pink versus Kizzy. This is basically uh, really a test of, of a, or and a testament of what the new net play can do because this is a Florida versus California. They're, they're far. Let's make a side bet for you all before this starts, everybody. We'll keep it basic. Once again, just tell us who you think is going to win. Your options are Kizzy K and Pink. Okay, Panda's Pink. They're both extremely strong. You got two minutes to bet it right now. Jump in there. Tell us what you think is going to happen. Almost ready, everybody. We're almost in there. Thank you, your humble messiah. Thanks, your humble messiah for the sub as well. I think that's that's Pink right now. Or, or uh, their opponent right now. It's hard to tell because I'm spectating. I'm ready to start whenever they're ready to start, by the way. Yeah, I believe that's the two of them. They look like they're, they're signed up and they're ready to go. Yeah, we're jumping into it. Winner semi number two, everybody. Again, it's three out of five. Kizzy K versus Pink. Uh, Pink is player one. Here's the swap, everybody. Pink is player one. Uh, player two is Kizzy. Mankind knew that they could All right, let's go. They're both strong. I actually don't know what's going to happen in this match. And they both have strong characters. I know that Soul is the one that's terrorizing the top of the tier list right now. Uh, but Kai is, I think that this is a fair matchup for Kai. Kai has some really good answers. Including keeping you in shock state basically the whole match. It's really hard for Soul to avoid the shock state. He kind of has to eat those. Bandit Revolver, raw, that was a really raw Bandit Revolver. And that's God, like, that's an answer? You can do that? So, Thick Patrick Star, when Kai has the Shock State on you, uh, many of his special moves that involve the Shock State get better. So, the Slash gets better, the Stun Dipper gets better, even the Fireball does a little bit more damage and a little more chip damage, if I'm not mistaken. Thick out. Ooh, wait, waiting for a bait. Wow. I'm seeing some high level stuff, chat. I really love what the players are doing with this new uh, backwards. Red Roman Cancel and backwards purple Roman Cancel. I like this a lot. It seems to bait a lot of things that the other Roman Cancels do not. Too far. Great air throw. Kizzy. That was a fake. That was a fake on the kick slash move that he likes to use. Good throw again. Mixed time. Close test in the far S into another throw. Beautiful. Beautiful. Pink. All throw mix. You know, that type of mix is going to be super effective on someone like Kizzy because he's reacting. And he's reacting in a way where he wants to 6P in between your strings. He wants to go for a down punch, down punch into something, things like that, right? That's his style of reacting. So by mixing in the throw a lot, you're creating something that's really 
you can react to the dash up of the throw, but the throw itself is unreactable. It's two frames, right? So you're creating a situation where you make them nervous because there's this one thing that they just can't react to no matter how hard they try, and it's the close throw. You can tech, that's the best you can do. Dola. That's a punish. Ooh, they got far S instead of close S. The startup was slower. Vortex combo, because he didn't, did not want to see it. None of those today, please. I would like to fight it out. Vapor Thrust denied. I don't think so today, my friend. That's tough. That's tough. Bandit Bringer. Yeah, the Slash, the slash Volcanic Viper is one of the best uppercuts in the game. Uh, it's really hard to punish, and it's more difficult to throw them out of it than some of the other uppercuts. The heavy uppercut, you can throw that pretty consistently if you try for the immediate throw. Uh, but the Slash Volcanic Viper, good luck throwing those. It's very hard. Six P. That was nice. It didn't matter what button they pressed once they were airborne, and that was God. Kizzy, how do you keep doing this? No, the burst still worked. I actually thought he was invincible. Crazy. Bro, this main theme is driving me crazy, and so is the smash. Small minus, nice six P. You can do that. This guy's combos are off the chain. Counter hit 6P, straight to the ride, the lightning. I confirmed those. Gunflame, Vortex, extension. We even got Slash as an extension. That was sick. Burst. You must burst there. I don't think you can take that. Four star RC after the 6H. It's pretty minus on hit and on block. Okay. Good life. Into the counter hit. Don't try to move. It's not your turn. Ooh, now it's your turn. Now it's your turn. Sick counter hit. Pink. Cross up attempt denied by the standing kick. Two for pink right now. Looking very strong. So the standing kick of soul, it's a good all purpose button. Uh, the first hit is three frames. You guys know it already. The second hit is around five frames, I think. So even when the far away hit hits, uh, it's still very good as a quick button to keep them out. Thank you, Sway. Thanks for the support, Sway. All love, everybody. Right now, it's winner semis. We're going to see who's going to get to the top three. Pink was not lying today when they told me what they told me. They were like, I've been waiting for this day. I've been waiting for this day, they said. They were not kidding. They were really waiting for this day. Vortex. Tried to take the burst as well. Doda. No, it didn't work. Plus. More plus. Into the throw. No RC. Yeah, we can RC. Smart. Straight to the Volcanic Viper. There was no easy opportunity to escape that there. No, Shimano, they were waiting for this tournament, is what Punk had to say. Apparently, Pink really confident tonight that they can do well. And they've been, they've been proving it. They've been proving it. One round away for them to make it into the top three guaranteed. Humongous prize pool tonight. Over $1,300. That's big boy dollars. And you all have been contributing at home with your subs and everything else. So best of you, a prize pool like that. Pink is on a mission. And there's no more burst for Kizzy. This is it. They must survive this round somehow. 6S. 6S again. The 6S was too good. That I think that was a 3-0. That was a sweep. Wow, Pink. You weren't kidding when you told us that you were going to do well tonight. It wasn't a joke. Guaranteed top three, everybody. Someone said, pay me. <laughs> Someone said, pay me in the chat. Pay me. Well, Pink's getting paid. I know all the top eight's getting something, but impressive start for them. And they got a sweep at the top eight winner's side. Kizzy K is still not out of it. They're guaranteed top five. And we're going to get ready for... Oh, the players are already ready for the next one. Well, let me jump on there. Spectate. Uh, they might be. I see two players sitting here about the player, or at least one player. I can't tell the names right now. But oh, you, if y'all are ready, I'm ready, chat. Or players, y'all can jump on in. I see that they're both there. I think they're both there. Yeah, I'm ready. So we're going to lose this top eight round one, everyone. We're going to jump straight into it. I'll talk to you about the match and everything else after this match. This is another three out of five, just so you know. The winner was pink of the last match. So this one should be School Bus versus Rakir, right? Loses top eight round one. Uh, School Bus is on the player one, and Rakir is on the player two. Props to both these players for making all the way back on loser's side, by the way. We saw them defeated 
around the round four point of the tournament, and they both made it back. That's clutch. All right, school bus P1. Rakir is player two. Let's make a bet for you all. I know y'all love the bets. I love the bets too. Who will win? Only one minute this time because the match has begun. School bus and Rakir. Ramlethal versus Chip. This is another match that I think is very representative of the new system of Strive compared to Xrd or Rev2, something like that. Ramlethal even is a much different character. Nice throw OTG into mix, forcing the burst out of Rakir. Purple RC. Oh, that was a really heavy block stun. It makes sense because it is a super. Throw attempt denied by the back dash of School Bus. Good. Good dash 2K. Wow, Rakir. Oh, that does count as that does count as a hit on chip. That was that was nuts. That does count. So when you hit the gamma blade, when you hit the gamma blade, it does count as damaging chip. I don't know if you can can you kill him like that? I wonder about that. You can definitely do a lot of damage. Okay, so you, you straight up can kill him that way too. Sounds like. Alright. Stand heavy. Alpha Blade. Nice air throw. That was a good answer. But Rikir still with a good lead in this round and a good escape. Excellent escape. Using those Roman cancels. Purple, blue, red. All the colors. And took the burst. That's a big deal. That's a huge deal. They... They... How can I say this? Chip has a, a chance of taking out School Bus without School Bus being able to get another burst. It's possible. Especially if you jump out of those throws. Cross up mix off the jump S. Only a two piece there. I don't think she can get anything real unless you're close enough to the corner. Then she can get the sword after. Alpha Blade. Extension. What you can see Rakir do. Ooh, that was a sick mix and took the burst. School bus. School bus. Really good matchup from both players so far. School bus with game number one. One thing that I noticed that Rakir is doing, although school bus is adjusting pretty well to it, is that whenever Rakir blocks a corner sword, if you notice, he goes for a quick dash into a button. So he does like a dash down kick down dust or a dash six P, something like that. So Rakir is trying to counteract the Ramlethal mix in the corner while making sure uh, that the sword explosion is a little bit out of range. That, that is tech and it is a part of the to approach the matchup, but keep in mind that school bus can also counteract that. Nice answer on the first cat scratch. Good job. Throw mix. You got you to guarantee. Ooh, jump 2K. Time to test those defenses. Will you flinch on the jump 2K? No. We're out of there. Back to the mid screen for school bus. And took the corner with the burst. Surprise. I'm out. Counter hit. Off the two piece. That string is really nice from Chip. You do the down S into down heavy. I think that's the notation. And it doesn't actually matter if he whips the if he whips the down end. So if you try to whiff punish the down S there, uh, the down heavy will actually counter hit you for trying to whiff punish. Really dangerous string. It's a little bit of a trap that you gotta watch out for from him. Banzai got the overhead. They were gonna make sure it was safe with the Roman cancer regardless. Sushi. 6P, go one. Denied the jump S with that. And a nice throw mix as well. Command grab. No RC, we're saving the meter. There's an RC. Sick combo of the jump dust. So 6K, Roman cancel, cancel. Jump dust, that was the mix there. And the damage was pretty solid. Rakir, tying it up. One to one. Yeah, I would say that chip... Uh, at first, we didn't really know how to rate the character chip. So I'm not surprised that a lot of people still consider this character... Uh, weak or that they, their early experience with the character was that he was weak uh, but I, I I don't know it seems pretty clear that he's a solid character he has weaknesses that's the thing you can be top tier and start weaknesses though that can happen he does have weaknesses I'm not saying that they're top tier or not top tier but Duel 
Tie score, everybody. Yeah, the more lap time you have, the more prep time that Batman has, the more powerful that he is. You know what it is. That's Chip. Chip is definitely prep time Batman. Beta Blade right through the cat scratch strings. Seems like that's the one thing that School Bus can't use to build momentum on Rakir. Rakir has a lot of good answers for the cat scratches. Plus frames off the low option. Throw attempt denied. And School Bus made it back to the mystery. Slash heavy. That's a combo. That's a combo. Burst safe. Is that Duff? It, it is Chip. Yeah, that's Duff. That's Duff. Woo! That Rambler throw burst safe stuff is cheap, School Bus. So cheap. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Jump heavy. Getting out of the corner. You know, you can scout that chat. One escape that the Ramble Throws Love School Bus included is they do double jump heavy to escape the corner because it's a cross up. But if you read that, you can air scoop that. The jump heavy still has starter. So air scoop those chat when you see them. You can grab her for that. Jump 2K. And it got a combo off the jump 2K. Wow. Gamma Blade for the plus. That was crazy plus. Shit again. Good super. RC for the follow-up. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. All your options were taken away from you, my friend. Two to one right now for school bus. Your options were taken away. It's not over. It's not over. But school bus is, is looking good to make it into the top five. Rakir needs to come back strong. Two games. Yeah, so Jazgar, you know, School Bus, he's at the level of the game where he does not often do burst vulnerable combos. So you generally have to expect that the default combo is going to be a burst save combo. You have to expect that. Uh, so you have to adjust your burst game for that. One thing that I noticed that Rakir can do to help out is maybe go burst more often and use the burst offensively while forcing the RC issue, forcing RCs, forcing supers, things like that. Okay, dual two. Rakir with the perfect to start it off. A little bit of chip time. Oh, we're moving. We're moving. Counter off the jump heavy. That's just a matchup. Chip versus Ramathal is high speed all the time. Slash heavy slash. Jump 2k again, and Rakir is in. Has an RC available. Nice chase down. Saving the meter. Command grab. Still saving. Alpha blade. Cross. Double cross. Didn't work. And school bus go burst out of it. That's a lot of meter. This is tough. No. Oh. Was that a bait? I'm not even sure. RC. Oh, my goodness. How did they know that was the right time to super like that? I guess because they had seen the setup previously. Because school bus saw that before. Rambler throw was brave enough to go for the super. 2S into 2H extension. Surprise mix. Surprise. I want a game three, says Rakir. Surprise. I want to go to the end, all right? I need to see the last game. The whiff 2S, 2H. So cheap. Don't try to whiff punish. You'll pay the price. A lot of meter available. This should be death if we have the right combo. No, I guess not. We need something different. Backdash, defensive throw for school bus. They can come back from justice. One combo is all it takes. Does? No. No, it didn't hit right. Cat scratch mix. That was brave. That was a really brave heavy after the first cat scratch. Is the second cat scratch, teach me chat, is the second cat scratch so slow that they can always press up on there? Or is that just that Rakir has got like reads? We're going on to the last game, everybody. So Rakir just knows that School Bus will not do the second cast crash. Or they're delaying it. Alright, so on to the last one. Yeah, that was that was close to say the least. That was a good call out from Rakir. Now we're going to the last game. 
Jump slash mix. Hard to deal with. Surprise. Get off. Jumping out of the mix immediately. That's a good choice. Slash heavy. No follow up with sword though. Ooh, that crossed up. Counter it off the back dash. And Rakir with the offensive burst trying to keep the corner. RC combo. This is a wall break. Just take it. Yep. Just take it. Back to the mid screen. Oh, and guaranteed combo because they were in slow mo. Really good choices by School Bus defensively. Purple cancel to escape the corner. Now we have the pressure on, and the 6k is good enough. Very hard to block move. He does not really get a combo from it consistently without meter, but it's a good way to earn some free damage or to close out a round. And Rakir is one away from making it top five. School Bus fought so hard to get to this point. It was extra cheap, especially with the confirms. But now you must guess. Empty low. That was a good one. That looked like another empty low. I think that the setup was a little off. Just slightly. And that allows School Bus to continue on. Nice! That was a good two-piece. Burst max off the beta blade. Is this a burst? Are we saving? Oh, we're saving. But Rakir turned it into a... He made it into a burst bait and a mix-up since they did not burst. Last chance for School Bus. Plus frames. Good low. The cast... Ooh, oh! Awareness. No, I, I noticed I messed up. I noticed I messed up. I got you. But, but, Rakir's alive. It's not over. Jump heavy. Look at the hitbox. That was the hilt of the sword that hit. That was not even the sword itself. Crazy. Final round. This is for all the marbles. This is to stay in the tournament. Jump 2k burst it. I don't want to get mixed. It's too scary for me. Should he can't. Oh, counter. That's a punish. That's a punish. Almost was a counter. Jump punch, escape in the corner, back to the mid screen, jump kick, stand kick, excuse me, catching that back dash. 6k RC. That's a wall break. Positive bonus time. What can we do with it? Ooh, cat scratch. That was dangerous. Nice, jump 2k. Are you serious? Call again. All the mix. Rakir has an RC. Rakir has an RC. This is dangerous. They have an RC and a burst. School bus, just holding on. Whatever buttons they can hold on with. Slash heavy. Cancel. Nice dash out. Rakir. Counter off the 6P. It's still not enough. And no RC was available. Counter hit jump S into the throw. They were being defensive because of the... Oh my god. I don't know. Is that... No way. School bus with the comeback. The super combo at the wall. Insane. Chat, what did, I, what did I just witness? Ramlethal. <laughs> ah, Rakir, you fought so well, Rakir. Everybody, I hope you enjoyed that. Good job. That was a dope match. Come on, that was sick, everybody. Ah. Unfortunately, you can't both win, but the good news is, thank you, chat, because thanks to y'all, Rakir's getting paid. Not really $40,000. I'm sorry, Rakir. But you're our top eight. <laughs> so you're going to get a piece of the prize pool tonight. Keep it up. I hope that you'll come back next week and show us even more of what you can do. Oh, we're ready for... They're, they're waiting for me for the next one already. My bad. All right. I'm, I'm joining in. I got you. Let's do it. I'm ready. Straight to the next one, y'all. Let's do it. That was hype. Support the crowdfund, everybody. If you enjoyed the match, please help them out. That, that was extra hype. I don't even know where I am anymore. I know that we're doing more losers bracket. Losers, Glacial Rain. Oh my god, Glacial Rain versus SQ. This is going to be dope. Looks like Glacial Rain is on the player one. And SQ is on the player two. You're going to have only one minute to bet it right now, everybody. So get into it. Losers top eight, round number one. All the top eight is going to get paid. Thanks to your humongous support at home, everybody. Squirrel. Squirrels are crafty, just so you know. And they know how to defend. Like with those standing punches. Combo. Counter hit. All right. Cross up. Good one. Good cross. Glacier Rain with the mix and SQ. Seen enough. Throw though. Now you must see another mix. Back turn. Ooh. Ooh. I think that there were three steps ahead when they needed to be two steps ahead. <laughs> they were too far ahead. Good cross. SQ with the green guard to try to escape. I see that SQ's throwing out some preemptive throws. Anybody notice that? I think that there was an expectation of a cross up there. 
play Shio Rain. You gotta use that knowledge well. They're grappling. Believe that. Ooh, that was, that was nasty. Glacial Rain. Looking for the ender. Defensive throw of SQ. You too close. You got too close. Round two. Oh, my God. Nice answer. Prediction. That's a part of it. Predicting when they want to escape SQ with the standing S. 6P. 6P. No. This house is defended. Finally got it with the jump heavy. Good cross as well. Overhead into low, into cross again. All the crosses, all the mix. Defensive throw, worked out. I guess you can't double cross on SQ. She knows that it's not real. Hobok. No burst available for Glacial Rain, so you have to take the combo, just how it is. It doesn't matter that it's slow motion because the button is that good. It doesn't matter that it's slow motion. <laughs> No, I'm just playing. I'm just playing. Yeah, Leo's really good. Honestly, both these characters are strong. I think. I think that these characters... Uh, Ramlethal is the one where people are singing the accolades of she might be top three in the whole game. But I think that Leo, as far as mix-up, uh, he's a top three mix-up character, I think. His mix is crazy once he gets started. A mocha make. Thank you for the sub. And thank you, everybody, that's been subscribing tonight and supporting us and the players. Thank you, Josh, as well. Lord Nerd Josh, jumping in there. Really looking forward to next week, Josh, when you can jump in with me and say what's up to the homies. It's going to be hype. Hopefully, we're going to get Kizzy K with us soon, too, and some others as well. Tonight, Kizzy's in the top eight, so we're going to we're gonna cheer them on. See how they can do it. This is all a combo. You have to take these. It's also hard knockdown afterwards, so you have to take the post mix-up. It's very strong. Positive bonus, post mix-up. It's another super combo, by the way, if they get the hit. There it is. They, you must burst. That was down. Stand S. RC. Should be just enough. Smart. Using the super. The positive bonus, you can see that the meter generation is really high. So one thing that's smart to do is when you have the positive bonus, just never red cancel. If you never red cancel, your meter generation is off the chain, as you can see. You just always have bar. This is a rushdown game. <laughs> Homie said, my friend tried to tell me this was a defensive game. This is this is a rushdown game, sir. Just so you know. <laughs> nice counter throw. SQ looking for the cross-ups. But a nice answer back. Glacier Rain. And the overhead is good. This is the bounce combo. This hurts. Wall break. <laughs> this is an offense game, sir. Combo. Glacier Wind actually has a lot of meter. That's what's saving them right now. They have a lot of meter and a burst. Any contact, any type of block is party time. No! The mess up. I don't even know what that was supposed to be. Was that a special move and they got too heavy by accident? Something like that? I'm not sure. 2 0 right now for SQ. Yeah, Pally Dan, that wall bounce combo of Leo, I don't really understand all the nuances to how to set it up, but I noticed that it's become popular amongst the strong Leo players. They really enjoyed that particular wall bounce combo. Perhaps it's consistency factor. It seems like very consistent. Dual one. Let's rock. Okay. Oh, uh, Gemini Dog, thanks. I'll take a look at that. I also would like to mod the song in the lobby to be continued on that combo. For now, we got Glacial Rain versus SQ. Glacial Rain with their back to the wall now in this set. They need three wins. SQ, one win of the next three is a guaranteed top five. When you purple RC the sword, there's no opportunity to jump out. They must guess the next mix-up. But if you escape the mix-up the way that Glacier Rain has, then you have a better chance of survival because they spent an RC there. 6P again. No uppercut at the end. Push back right into the sword for the post-mix. And she got the sword right back. That's, that's actually kind of cheap. You can 
use the sword to start a box string and then have enough time to end the box string with the sword again. Woo! Ramblethorn. Explosion mix. Cat scratch. Good up. Oh, the uppercut still was not enough. I think the counter hit freeze actually kept them there a little longer. So they had to take those. Cross up the knight again. No cross ups. You can't start that way. Okay, you gotta trick me first. One, two, three. Off the knockdown. Not enough meter for the RC or the super, but still solid damage. SQ using the yellow Roman cancel to escape. 6P again. That's so good. How much? Stand S must not have much recovery. Huh? You can stand S and then whip into 6P, and that's just a thing you can do, huh? Rambler Thaw. My power, though. No! I see those! She's even reacting to the non block string cross up. That's really good. That's reactions. No, you can't get in that way. I don't think so. Good upper. No, the same thing's going to happen. Yes, the same situation because it counter hit. Wow. Is that, is that secret tech? Is the tech there you make them want to uppercut and then you kill them? Because that that's scary. Okay, any Leo would try to uppercut there, of course, because the opportunity is there. Why would you not uppercut? That was a that was a 3-0 for SQ. Yeah, that was a 3-0. So Glacier Rain, give it up to Glacier Rain, everybody, who, as you saw, had astronomical mix-up tonight and was really strong. We didn't even get to see some of their best matches on the stream, I'm not going to lie to you. Uh, but you can see that top-notch Leo. Give it up to them. And thanks to all of you, of course. They're going to get... They're going to get... Uh, they're going to get hooked up. Thanks to all of you. Nope, that was a 3-0. It was a 3-0. So the next matchup, everybody, let's see if we can take a look at the bracket together really fast. The next matchup, the players are almost here already. They're almost ready, so I got to jump into it. It's going to be quarterfinals. I'm sorry, y'all. I just want to see where I'm going to make sure I'm in the right place. And this quarterfinal match should be uh, Kizzy versus School Bus. Is that right? Yeah. Cool. Great. Looking good. Let's get set up. Uh, one player is already here. That, is that Kizzy? Or is that school bus? I can't even tell. It won't tell me the name. Currently, it's going to be weekly. We're going to try to keep it going. Uh, everybody, by the way, if you're enjoying all the matches, uh, thanks to all of you. We currently have over $1,300 in the prize pool to support the players tonight. Uh, but we can use everything that you give to help out, everyone. So help us out if you can. Uh, we don't have any more of the free coupon code because you use them all, which is what I'm talking about. But you can still help out and support in a lot of other ways. You can donate. To the prize pool directly you can buy a shirt in the store you can use all the goodies on the sidebar of the crowdfund page as well and you can also donate directly here to us at team spooky uh, any sub you give us whether it's a regular sub a gift sub or your free prime sub it's going to help out the prize pool tonight i'll make sure to donate some money courtesy of all of you i'm ready when they're ready my bad or at least i'm spectating already so i think i'm good Whew. The nerves are really kicking in. Thanks for all the support, everybody. Y'all are amazing. Seriously. This has been a dope tournament tonight so far. Losers quarterfinal, everybody. And in this one, as I said, it's going to be Kizzy K representing Panda Global versus School Bus. Uh, so I expect the matchup is going to be like Ramlethal versus Kai. Expected matchup, everyone. Let's make some skull bets for you all at home. You tell me who you think is going to win. Your options, once again, are Kizzy K. That's your first option. And your second option is School Bus. They both have fought very hard to get to this point. School Bus had to fight it out uh, through winners for a significant portion of the tournament. Thank you very much, Omnix. Thank you, Omnix TSC. Thank you, FUD, for the sub. Uh, thank you, all the subs. There's a great many of you all tonight. Thanks, everybody. Omnix, thank you, FUD. Thank you, Avoiding the Roy. Thank you, Seven Banes. Thanks for your support. And everybody else. Looks like school bus is coming to the lobby right now, everybody. So we're about to get it started. Gufford. Thank you also, Gufford. Thank you for your sub. Sorry if you're not getting all the pop-ups that we do when I do the casual streams, everybody. But we're in tournament mode right now. Y'all know what it is. I appreciate all of you. Seriously, y'all are, are hooking it up big. I'll make sure to hook up some more money into the prize pool courtesy of you all at the end. I think that they deserve around like 1500 bucks by the end of it. 194 subscribers of Team Spooky. Thank you, everybody. Mankind new. Okay. So, uh, I have the sides flipped for you all, but I'll fix them right now. School bus is the player one. Chop. Player two is Kizzy K. Here you go. And it's three out of five. Loses quarters. 
128 players was confirmed in the tournament in total. And now we're down to the top, top five. Top eight all getting paid tonight thanks to you at home. Humongous support in the crowd. Oh, we have RC combos for this? Oh, I think that they were expecting a wall stick, but they turned it into a mix anyway. Blame the beast. Mankind knew that they could not change society. They couldn't beat their mate tendencies, so they blamed the Dolphins. Nice slow. Jump heavy. Pressure behind it. Oh, wow, the S still worked, even though they got hit by the down heavy and school bus. I think that's real because it's counter hit, right? No, oh, it was not a counter hit. Oh, my goodness. And what in the world is happening? Nerves. Top eight nerves. Top eight nerves. This is what I like to see. New games, new nerves, new situations. I love to see this. <laughs> Whoa. He's got some aim on those air throws. Oh, soy, you're too slow. Get in this corner. Plus, I need to know about this tech. What is it with the up red cancels on block? Dude, this is definitely tech. I just don't know what the function of it is. Ride the lightning. Oh, Hotashi, we had some people that I wanted to do it with, but the, the staff vetoed me. They were like, no, all these people are in the tournament, so they can't commentate. So it's, I'm holding it down. <laughs> Kizzy was one of the scheduled commentators originally. He was going to join us. Instead, he's top eight, top five. He's trying to get dollars. Counter. That's so good. I'm telling y'all chat, the non-charge dust, listen to me, the non-charge dust, 20 frames average for most characters, it's really hard to block. There's a reason why the RC combo scales so much. There is definitely a reason. Plus frames. So cool. Got the shock state. That was sick! Was that intentional? Excellent dash by school bus. Getting into the blind spot. Jump heavy. Counter hit. That's a super. That's a super. No. Good try. I see what you tried to do, school bus. They tried to turn it into a super combo because they had two RCs. Purple cancel. Plus. Good block. Are you serious? Kizzy tried the move. Kizzy tried the move at the end, and School Bus is going to take the first game 1 to 0. They're playing some, some high level stuff tonight, chat. I hope y'all are enjoying this. They're definitely both showing you what they can do. Kizzy, excellent space control, really good usage of the air grabs and the tricks as well. We'll see how game number two can go. It is three out of five, confirmed. What up, Liston? What's good, Holmes? Angie X Ladiva. Thank you, Angie X Ladiva. Thanks for the sub. It's greatly appreciated. Here we go. School Bus definitely was an undernight monster, to say the least. A big part of the TSB slash the Lunar Face events. Tricky strings. School Bus. Oh, soy. You must guess. And now I have Shock State. More Shock State. Lightning. I am the Lord of Lightning. Oh, that's what they tried to do before. I see. So you hit with a heavy, and then you put them in slow mode after the heavy attack? Hit stun? That's interesting. That opened kind of a new world for me as far as combos. You can do that? So it works like, it works like, Eagle of Tyrant is correct. I'm assuming it works like when you do the Roman cancel, cancel. You're not actually hitting with the red cancel, so you don't have that one extra hit of scaling in the combo. That's really interesting tech. Okay. Slash heavy. 
Good. Oh, almost, almost. They were almost out of there. But now, now, Kizzy, you must suffer. You must take this corner. And School Bus is handling it well. Notice that School Bus is giving them a really wide berth. He's staying at a certain range where the jump slash and the jump heavy slash are effective. That's because actually up close, the Kai buttons are better than hers a little bit. So you have to always, you need, you need this range, the jump slash range. Don't ever let them get close. Combo time. Wow, school bus. So I'll just say, JJ, there's two different schools of thoughts on that, okay? You can be of the, the half-empty style and say, oh, Kai can't ever get in. Or you can be of the glass-full style and say, well, School Bus is just really good in this matchup at keeping Kai at a certain range. And it's up to Kizzy to change their style and get around that. Okay, I'll jump in there with you in a second, Josh, if you want to jump in. Let me just try to figure out how to do this without breaking everything, Josh, if you want to try to do it. I just need a minute. First, let's try to fix all this. The cat scratch is pretty good for slowing things down. Even if you never really finish it or you don't get the combo, it's like a, a wait type of move. You can force them. So just stay there for a while. Catch your breath. Thank you, Curl, for hooking up V for Charlie as well. Really kind of you, my friend. Ride the lightning. It is a wall break. Positive bonus and hard knockdown for Kizzy now. Let's mix. Ooh, you can't even back dash. Not even that works? Wow. It's just straight up a safe jump, huh? Crazy. All right. Nice jump kick. And we're in. Got the throw as well. Of course, they're going to defend. Plus frame. So the forward kick. Nice. That's the Kai special. He's one of the characters that has a consistent combo of the down punch, down punch, six punch. Really useful, trust me. Having a real down punch combo, that's a big deal. She's faster. School bus. Oh, was that a side switch attempt? You had a side switch combo there? That looked extra cheap, whatever that was. Good throw. RC again. Keeping it. Oh, was that burst safe? Was that all burst safe? That was sick. Yo, I'm seeing some new Kai combo routes say that I never seen before. That was dope. Ooh, and this is exactly why we do what we do because I think the, the thing just messed up on me. Let's see. Are we still in? Are we okay? We're still in? Oh, we're still in. Hey, I'm so glad I did this the way I did it. We're still in. Great. It didn't matter. Cool. All right. So it's two to one right now for School Bus. Yeah, the lobby won that match, but we're still good. Josh, I got you in a bit, bro. I'm just got to focus on the lobby. Otherwise, I would jump in there with you. I'll try to give you a spectator also and see if that works, I guess. Uh, it will be getting guards. It will definitely be on YouTube if you would like to see it. Worry not. Nice counter slash. Oh, they were closer. Now we're finally seeing what that up RC is about. Oh, that's cool. So when you use the up RC, you get a higher bounce than the neutral RC? Or is that to set up the air combo? That was cool. That definitely was not your one of the mill round with combo that we just saw. There it is again. Oh, that's cheap. Okay. No, that's definitely not a flex. Those are those, there's a thought process behind that. I've been seeing that a lot with the purple cancel today. I do wonder if that makes it easier for you to see their burst or something like that. I've seen a lot of up purple cancel. Up purple cancel, I dare you to burst on my up. Stuff like that. Counter hit, jump heavy. Straight to ride the lightning for the wall break. Even that was plus, huh? No shock state plus? Counter hit, jump S. No RC from School Bus. Saving those meters. This might be an RC. Here it is. Not per safe. We're willing to risk those. And it works. Yeah, so thank you, Puppy, for explaining. When you wall break the wall with a super, uh, you put them in hard knockdown state. So you can get a mix-up. When you wall break with a regular combo, the situation is somewhat neutral. It's pretty much neutral. I think you have only a tiny amount of plus there. K 
Kizzy in a good spot. Using the plus frames. Good escape. School bus. But Kizzy. Ooh, nice, man. I see why Kizzy saves the Stun Dipper. Because if you do it all the time, then they block lower line. It's not as effective. But otherwise, people think they can walk out. Good block. That was not safe, I think. I'm not sure what the correct punish was there for Kizzy. Okay. Dash up throw deny. Force to burst. And school bust with a lot of meter. Purple cancel for the slow-mo. They have the positive bonus too. Nice jump dust combo. Jump kick, jump dust. Into the throw RC. They don't have a burst. They don't have a burst. And the correct combo means that Kizzy is making it to the last game. Two to two. Ooh, my heart is really pumping, child. I don't know where I am right now. I'm all over the place. <sighs> this is hype, child. School Bus versus Kizzy K is top five. The winners guaranteed top four. Great match so far between the two of them. I'm sweating, y'all. I don't know what's about to happen. Here we go. This is it. This is it. This is the same thing I say about Anji, uh, Dust Flap. People say that Anji is bad or like the second worst or something. I'm like, I don't believe that until Lost Soul says that. If Lost Soul says that Anji is bad, then I believe it. I think that Lost Soul is making Anji look godlike. And we have some other ones out there too. Thank you. Oh my God. Thank you so much, RS Black Rose. Thank you, Josh, for the humongous support. Thank you. All right, let's get into it, everybody. This next match. Don't forget to thank RS Black Rose if y'all got a gift sub just now. Really generous. Thanks, homie. Great air throw. And the OTG after that's guaranteed if they do it fast enough. Another nice throw to start it off at school bus. Oh, my goodness. The throws are coming out, Kai. You like to block. That means you're vulnerable to the grab. You like to block Kizzy. I can say, ooh, you really like to block Kizzy. I see you. But you got away from the goal burst. That's a good start. Jump heavy for school bus. Into the fadeaway jump S. Another fa fadeaway. Fadeaway jump S is really hard to deal with, as you can see. Forced to burst. Could this be it for our hero, Kizzy K? They fought really well to get to this point. A guaranteed top five with the Kai. He's not shattering the tier list, but he's killing it. Well, jump heavy again into the RC. Is it enough? No, no. It's not enough. Oh, what a back dash into the stun dipper ender. They have an RC. Because he does have an RC. A ride the lightning or something like that will be godlike right now. Vapor thrust RC. Is this RTL? Do we just do it? Oh my god. That's a war break. That's a hard knockdown. Is she going to super? Will she super? She did not super. Kizzy faded. Hobak. Plus. Fade away. Oh my god. Clenched the whole match. I can't take it. <sighs> Ramlethal. All right, everybody. Give it up to School Bus, who's going to take it 3 to 2 over Kizzy K. Amazing matchup. That was a lot of fun to watch. Woo! Ramlethal from School Bus. Everybody now in the chat is like, I hate Ramlethal. Ramblethor is my least favorite character. Someone in the chat's probably saying that. All right, everybody. Give me a minute, uh, chat and staff, because I want to see if I can get the homie Josh to join us for the rest of this. So let me give that a try and see if I can get it to work. Hold on, y'all, because they've been waiting for me the whole time. Let's see. So step one is let's try this. I'll tell you when uh, we're ready for the next one, bro. I'm going to try to do this as quick as possible. So step one, I'm going to jump in here, and I'm going to try to turn on my, my video or whatever for Josh and go there. I don't know if you can hear me, Lord Nerd Josh. Oh, I have to have you meet you, my Can body. you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you, bro. How you doing? I'm doing good. I'm, I'm good, hyped Josh. to watch some more gear. <laughs> no doubt, bro. Stick around, Josh, because sorry if I sound rushed, but I promise you that we're going to have some dope matches coming up in just a minute, homie. Thanks for helping out and supporting it. I got to spectate this next one for y'all, and then I'm going to try to give you, Josh, a feed of the game on Discord if I can, all right? But I don't know if it's going to work off the bat, so forgive me if it acts up or something at first, all right? No, it's fine. Take your time. All right, so here you go. Share my screen. I'm going to try to share Guilty Gear to you, Josh. And in the meantime, sorry, what, what was that, bro? Understood. SQ will be right back. So that's perfect timing for me. Let me know if you can see the feed now, Josh. You might be able to see it. Uh, 
I see the OBS camera. Oh, How no, about no, the other one? You should, you should have me oh, and you should have the now. game. I can see it now. Great. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, if yeah, you yeah, have yeah, the audio, then that makes it extra good because then it's all good. Now I'm going to try to spectate this. And I'll tell you what the next match is, everybody at home. Let's take a look together. Ooh, I'm nervous. These have been godlike. Is Diaphone oh, versus SQ, Josh. Let me know how Josh sounds, Chad, if I have to turn him up oh, more for y'all or whatever. Diaphone versus SQ? That's right. Yo, Who's his quarters, is Josh? Hype. Damn. There's a lot of Kelly fans in the chat. I've seen that. So, oh, yeah. I don't know. She's like, been beasting this, the whole tournament. Both, both these players have been grinding so much uh it should be just interesting in general especially like how season one grand blue both players had a lot of experience versus each other so i wonder how that's gonna translate to this game too agreed they had they a little bit about each other's play style at least i'm with you on that True. all right chat i'm trusting y'all hopefully everything sounds good let me know if i need to adjust josh or anything and i'll do that as i go uh, let's try to get set up for this next losers quarters it should be uh diaphone versus sq sq will be returning in just a moment and uh, while she returns, let's let's give you guys some skull bets, y'all. Y'all can bet it. Just another good one to bet. Tell me who you think is going to win the match. Again, it's Diaphone or Diaphony. If you prefer, on the player one, on the player two, it's SQ. It's Eno versus Ramblethor. So that's an interesting matchup and a fun Yo! matchup, I think. We'll I didn't even goes. see the match for Eno. 1,500? Y'all Thank ridiculous. you, everybody, again, for doing it. I haven't. Yeah, I'm good whenever they're good. Are they waiting for me? My bad. I thought we were still waiting for SQ. Okay, cool. Now I'm ready then whenever they're ready to go. Perfect. Cool. So it looks like we're about to begin the next one in just a moment. Everybody stick around. Should be really hype. My heart is pumping, Josh. I'm, ha I'm happy that you're no, here to back you. me up. I need your help. <laughs> I might <laughs> not make good. it through the I'm night. Sorry. These are too hype. <laughs> I've, I've been talking about gear since like 7.30 a.m. So I'm, I'm ready. Let's do this. All right, no doubt. <laughs> So Diaphone is on the player one, Josh. Just you know, SQ's on player two. Cool. This might be is is this double jeopardy? Did they fight this tournament? I know they fought in a past tournament. I don't know if they Men fought in this one. We'll find out, society. I guess. There's I'll so many tournaments right now, I'm not even sure. Like uh I've just been talking to people about other events and they haven't seen the ones I've seen, but they've seen ones I haven't. So it's like it's been uh, a fun time talking about Strive competitively. Definitely. It's hard Ooh, to see all punishment. the matches and all the tech. True. No. Like playing the game constantly and watching it is you gotta be skydiving right now. What a throw. Great throw. Great six B to escape the corner though from Diaphone as well. Good six P. Wow. Very Ooh, combo. The burst out. Okay. Oh, stroke a big tree under the Wow. You know, Diaphone has been using that specifically to beat that move in the Ramlethal matchup. It's been working really well for them tonight. Yeah, the low profile application on that move is legacy very strong. Good yellow cancel. Slip. And a two-piece string. Cool, Joker Jordan. I'm glad you're enjoying it. This game is sick. Thank you, Arxis. Board punch started. Seems like the forward punch and the, the stroke are Diaphone's answers to this matchup. A lot of 6P, a lot of stroke. Those are two main approaches. See? Yeah, trying to go for the slash or heavy one. Even though the slash one's unsafe. Wow, what a mix there. Going for it again into the super. That would have been safe on block. Ooh, the throw again. No fear. Close S. It's a full hurt. combo. Yeah. Time Damn. for plus. You must guess. Yep. Block oh. oh, no throw. Yup, here we come, BRC. Go burst. Go burst. Oh, you're gonna block forever. Oh no. No escape. Okay. No escape. Good coverage of space so, by SQ there. So SQ takes so game number one. The, I'm so used to those Ramlethal Fenrich uh, positive streaks now. I'm like, anytime I see positive Ram, I'm like expecting throw or that. I'm like, oh my god. Yeah, pretty much. One thing that's nice about Ramblethor is that you, you start with a combo and you end with super like that. And then the post mix up, if you get the hit, a lot of characters have the same type of application. But especially for Ramblethor, that post hit after the super is, that's curtains. You, you can't take that hit. Even the throw, you True. can't take that a lot of the time. The yeah, SP's been super strong these past few weeks. I'm not surprised on the game lead here, but Diaphone, no slouch either. 
Definitely a grinder. I'm really uh, happy with how the balance on Wall Break fruit. ended up. At first, people really did not want, like Wall Break, myself included. Now, I'm just like, the wall might as well be the corner half the time. Wall Break is actually yeah. really good. I, I, I think that's actually the comeback mechanic of this game. Because sometimes you need the extra meter for some matchups. And others, you might want to go for the hard knockdown. You know? Big game. Slash. SQ. Extremely strong. Good block on the overhead. 6P, starting it off. That cross up jump heavy is nasty. So strong. Uh -oh. Throw on the whip. Oh, again. Her, da her dash is really good, huh? It's not just me. She's really good at whip punishing buttons with the dash up throw. That's definitely a round of throw skill. The stroke under, the stance flash. Again, tried to finagle something there, but the drag. Ooh, counter hit 2D, going to the corner. Got like confirm. SQ. 2-0 right now for SQ. Oh. I don't even know what to say. She's got me. <laughs> the chat's going, wow. <laughs> They're just like, wow, you can Yo. do all this. Welcome to oh, the I power of Ramlethal. Wow. <laughs> I, I like to the, it. The power of Ramlethal. All right, and die for all say on Faust. All I'm gonna say on Faust is mm -hmm. that at least my blood pressure is down. He might be good. <laughs> I don't even know. This game is is, okay. is different. That's that's my conclusion. This <laughs> game is just different. different. It's a different game. I believe in Naga. Just give him time. He's already looking great. Nice low again. Wow. Yeah, using the strokes really well. It's a true low. It's evasive, as you saw, and it's a tricky mix. Ooh, the air dash almost worked. Almost worked. But SQ with a small lead now. Counter hit. Super. Oh my god, it hurts. And you get the OTG after because why not? I think that's only counter hit you get the OTG. I could be wrong. Still, that OTG is crazy. Counter off the 6 P. Oh, again. In the knockdown, he knows. It gets the counter hit slash. It. Catching dive phone, trying to escape the corner there. You, maybe it was like a dive kick or a throw, but great I don't counter. even know. They were just trying to utilize their movement, I imagine. But SQ, True. you can see shutting that down. A uh, dive phone trying yeah. really hard to be evasive in that set. A lot of good 6Ps, a lot of good strokes to go under the tricks, and a lot of good aerial movement. Uh, but SQ was very dominant, especially with her usage of the jump S. That button is like a nightmare button if you use it the way that she uses it. Nightmare Wait, was button. that a sweep? Jump S. Oh, yeah, it was, that a, was sweep. a sweep. That was a sweep. Yo. <laughs> Sweep it up. Sorry, y'all. Sweep number eight of the evening, by the way. Woo! The sweeps are crazy. We're going on to where are we at now? Losers quarters two, right? We have one more quarters left. No, wow. We're ready for top four. Chad, how about that? Yeah, I'm ready. I guess if they're ready. It's still three out of five, everyone. Uh, so I'm going to wait for them to jump in. But the next matchup is going to be Fernal versus Pandas Pink. Give I got to especially give it up to Pink, who this was like a cold shot for Pink. Y'all don't even know, but Pink more or less told me in the chat, in the Twitter, that they were going to body everybody. And they're doing really well so far. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, like yeah, that. I'm ready to, whenever they want to jump in, I guess. It's supposed to be Pink versus Ferno. I just need one of them to jump on the cap so I can spec. And then we should be good. Thanks for joining us, Josh. Let me know if anything breaks or anything, and I'll try to help you out since this was all last minute. No, I got you. Everybody, nah, the Match Arena, thanks to all of you, is over $1,500. I will give you all a proper thank you at the end, all you top donators, because I appreciate all of you. For now, we want to keep the tournament moving quick because the pace has been excellent and we don't we don't want to stop. So let's keep it going. You can still support and help out. Your support has been astronomical so far. $1,500 for a single tournament. You know that anybody that's an FGC player, they're thinking thumbs up right now if they're in this tournament. So thank you, everybody, for doing it. Yeah. But you know, there's still more to go, so help if you can. Yeah, not very many Faust players tonight. I'm sorry, everybody. <laughs> Give it time. Yeah, we'll okay, see how they I do I might even come time. back. I'm just, I'm just loving Axel. I'm like, whoa. I was a little stressed out, and cool. now I'm, I'm liking another character. I think that Axel is is one of the most cool characters. All right, so I'm, I think I'm spectating correctly now, right? Let's see. It looks right. So it's gonna be uh, Ferno versus Pandas Pink. It looks like Pink is gonna be on the player one side, and Ferno is gonna be player two. It's winners final, but it's still three out of five. Is that right? We're good? Cool. All right. So I'm ready to go when they're ready to go. Yep. Yeah, I'm ready. No, I'm ready. 
I mean, there's still, I'll say on the Faust discussion before the match, there's still tech we're not utilizing. Like, if you, if you, uh, combo into the, the, the super and you, uh, awaken a little Faust, the little Faust doesn't come till after the super. So even if you don't break the wall, technically, you could set up, uh, item meaties and follow up and get, uh, high low setups. That's one application okay. I haven't really been going for. I think that, but, you know, I it's think that is. His blue cancel tech, I think that his blue cancel tech has a lot of potential. It's just that blue cancel oh, yeah. is one of the trickiest things to utilize. Oh, by the way, I'm good whenever sure. they're good. Hopefully they know that it's good. Okay, they probably know. I'm just making sure. All right. They might just be getting ready. So it's pink versus Ferno. Winners finals is top three. Congratulations, Ferno, by the way, who was probably the biggest surprise of the tournament for all of us. Mm -hmm. Look at that level. Almost level 1,000 with the May. Woo! That's a beast right there. Yes, it will be going on YouTube, Nox turn. So look forward to it. Here we go, everybody. Pink player one, Ferno player two. It's three out of five. Talk to get key. Oh, those jump H. Yep. Oh, Funk right in there with the stand slash. Fafner, shake my hand. Two of the poster characters of the game right now, Soul and Mei. They're both really good at bullying. That's their job. Lock them, sock them, Soul bots. Good answer. And Pink with the lead. Has the corner. Good mix. Wow, you couldn't even up back that, huh? Gunflame Fink did not work. Totsugeki. Using the slip for the throw as well. Ferno. Ooh. Oh, the wall break gave them a free combo. The wall break helped out. Wow. <laughs> it was like, Punk was trying to look ahead. I mean, Pink was trying to look ahead. But, you know, the, the, the little balloon ball calling him out Ooh. now. That's hard to do. They're trying to 6S through the, the Dolphin. You can do that, but yeah. the spacing is pretty space independent to get that to work. Good luck. Mm -hmm. So much free damage there from Ferno. And they're just taking the pressure. Oh, sorry, see. Still not enough. Both around the same amount of health at the mid screen. Pink with the corner. Double L. Ooh, it uh, was not a counter. It was not a counter. So only S Heavy counter? was allowed there, I think. There's a counter. Too far yeah. for the gun flame. Well, Sick yeah. air throw. OTG, right? Still not enough. Not enough, though. The bringer in for the Totsugeki. Totsugeki. Oh, RCVV ready. That was a, was it a, a throw cold out? shot. No. A cold shot. <laughs> I'm coming in with the Dolphins again. Oh, no. Stand flat. Vortex confirmed. Vortex. Sick. Ooh, we Big got those. Oh. RC the, the trade. trade with the purple cancel. Could have been a lot worse within that forward slash, but man, the counter half the Totsugeki burst out. It was a good burst. Looked at the right time. Minus one around there. Vortex did not oh. work. Only a small put, but Ferno oh. went for the command grab. Okay. They could have war broke with Super and killed. I think. I think that Ferno could have killed there. Beach ball RC mix-ups from her, but you know, just regular beach ball is working out so much here. You know, they might be saving that, Josh, because Ferno had some tech for us a little earlier, where what they did was beach ball, purple cancel, and then 6k, yeah. the overhead, after the, the purple cancel, to make it a combo off the beach ball. So they definitely have tech there. I played D smooth along set, and they had a, a really dirty beach ball RC setup that would catch up back. She definitely has some dirt with it. Mm. Yeah, something like that, Zana G1. It's small minus, basically. But that small minus is enough where they can take their turn back if they're aware after they block it. Bobby. Hey, good conversion. <laughs> I just know his pink's name. It's funny. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice throw. CFN trash. Yeah. Good super. Oh, sea World. I love the dolphins and the whales. Vortex. It's pretty cutie. Minus. Oh. Stand punch. Mm -hmm. Could have been worse. Furno's pretty. If I could say that they have a minor weakness, they're really conservative with their punishment. Oh. Other than that, a lot oh, of strengths from Furno tonight. Nice jump back heavy. That anchor. 
swing Six that P. around. Whoa, what a board point. Oh, he's pressing buttons. He's pressing buttons. Believe that. Pressing all the buttons. Plus frames. Oh, Forward yeah. S. That's like plus 11 or something. Ooh. Mm -hmm. It's really hit. plus. Wall break is the kill. Wow. That was a really great round for Pink. They need this round to also Everything. go that well. The jump A is just going to the Totsugeki. Totsugeki. Trades. Count hit off the cancel. That was clean. Good run up. Sick block. Stand slash me. pressure. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, wow. that was sick. The light combo. I like it. Plus frames. Bates. Oh, smart. Man, really good reactions. I really love what Pink did there just now. So, how can I explain? Really high level of exchange. When you instant block a button, right? That's not that minus. You know, you're actually putting yourself in a slightly worse situation because instead of it being the standard pushback, you're left closer to the opponent. So if Pink can capitalize like they did just now, they can actually take advantage of the fact that they stayed a little closer. 1-1 one, one is the right, score. It's high up. Yeah. So game three. I mean, Pink that had pretty good adjustment there, but I still feel like Ferno is getting away with a lot of stuff in the neutral that Pink still not uh, ready for. It. Oh, what a I got you. I don't really know. You know, it's funny to talk about a button that won. even Soul can answer. I don't know that Soul has a real answer for that button. Jump heavy. He, he can't That's really true. answer that easily. So that might just be a dynamic of be, the matchup. That could be true. Just like, oh, this character got three frame. Oh, these red throws. Dust attempt denied. Double S for the follow up. Oh, that was a clean follow up. Ooh. Oh, the whiff. Oh, Not that a was jump. That's Dan first. Okay. Wow. Oh, my God. How good is the hitbox on Totsugeki? <laughs> and the command grab. You got to watch out. Definitely bringing back that action core flavor in this game in the mix. No doubt. 6P, denied. The spacing was wrong. 3P, swap the 6S. Sick! Oh my god, he had to do a slash dust, uh, right? He could have gotten more. I wonder if he has those routes on deck. Peppers. Peppers. Oh, but bad enough. combo. That's a close. Sick extension using the RC hey. for the last part. Yeah, just to make sure. That's the net meter. That's, right that's, punish. that's punish. That's punish. That's punish. Nice one. And we have the corner. Plus frames time. Oh, yeah. You're not moving for a while. I promise you that. <laughs> oh, we <laughs> all. I'm a fan. The RC, but still gets clipped. The jump heavy, I'm telling you, that's that's the button that Ferno needs to press. That's the answer. Not enough. Still need more. What the throw? Oh my god, this is Was that a mix? I don't even know what that was. Was that a mix or a combo drop? I'll never know. Oh. Bandit bring it to escape. Go burst did not work. Pinky just a little jump more pump. damage to close it out. Backdash bait. She has pixels, but one combo. One combo would even this up or even get the kill if it's a wall break. This is frightening. I know, just waiting. Oh, that was smart. Eights. That was smart. All right, yeah, pink the two meter, to one. You know, he, he knew Ferno wanted to get that instant air dash heavy, so just committed to that long range gun that, claim no, game that was paid off. Even if you trade there, it's a victory for you. All right, everybody. So this is potential match point for Pink. They could put themselves in the grand finals. Is Street Fighter actually the best at Guilty Gear all along? Duel one. Let's rock. Ooh. I mean, Pink was pretty good at BB Tag. Definitely agreed, got a lot of agreed. results in that game as well. Agreed. And played Elfel, played Mar plays Marvel, plays everything. Ooh. Success into confirm. I he's getting he's getting pretty 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 aggressive with his strings now. Seems like he's quite comfortable. A lot of more Fafner in the strings too. Ooh, Totsugeki RC, is so fast. 
Beach ball. We playing volleyball now. Set. Oh. Too slow. Too slow. Oh, and forced the trade on the Dolphin. Cross under. Broke up the charge, but didn't get a combo. That's tough. That's tough. Totsugeki. <laughs> <laughs> All is right. Explosive. Yeah, May, that's her job. Charge at you and get the counter. <laughs> Interrupt anything. It doesn't matter what it is. Counter! That's my job. Talk to your key. Okay. Getting through that anti air. Pink not amused. Getting caught up, though. Has to make sure. Nice. Spacing with the forward slash. I mean, that move is like a fortress. But wow, she gets in. I gotta like, oh. I gotta, I gotta really love this tech that Frono's using. By always comboing straight to the RC, there's no opportunity for you to slip out of the counter. It's oh. you have to take the combo. Yo, blue cancel, oh, escape. Oh, he he went Bro. under it with the count dust, and then he got a combo, but it was too far because she oh, jumped. Fortune. Chase down, fake out, air throw. What did it throw? Solid. They are you playing sure guilty gear. Play gear. Let's go. Yeah, right. I mean, that was an air. I, th I think Pinky playing some gear. That's enough for me. Good block. I'm the jump back heavy. You can't answer it, but you can block it. That is an answer. Bandit revolver in the air. No, that was the wrong combo. That was the wrong combo. Something oh. was off about that. Actually, Punk got a little bit lucky off of that one, I think. Far S. Block strings. Totsugeki. It's just haymakers. They're throwing haymakers at each other. It's like uh, the last round of a 12-round battle. Blocking is forgotten. Just throw whatever you ooh. can throw. Just throw punches. Doesn't Vortex. matter if everything connects. Just fill the screen. If you can attack, attack. Oh. Took the gold burst, but it's safe because it's gold burst. It's only a lot. Small minus. I don't know. Trying to get oh, around oh, here. 6P. Oh, go on, go on. And RC. And he unskilled the combo. In. It's still not enough. Yeah. He didn't get a wall break. Wall break would have been tough. Minus one. Oh, minus two even. Bringer. Oh, no. <laughs> Trying to get the OTG damage. Could have went for a 2K. No. Oh, but my hey. goodness. Hey. I think that was the kill Let's if they had gotten the OTG, is. right? I think that was the kill. So right. close. Oh, wait. It's 3-1. Yeah. It's 3-1. That means that pink is going to take. Oh, my goodness. I even got it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You, you, Yo. you said it. Pink with the 3-1 already. Good job, Pink. Hey. The cold shot worked, Pink. Well done. They definitely said, <laughs> I've been waiting for this. What's that? <laughs> uh, it was Pink 3 to 1 over Ferno. So, Josh, we're going to jump straight Let's into the it. next match, Lord, Lord, Lord Josh. So, stick around if you want to see it. it. I just got to spectate, and we're going to jump into it. A uh, loser semis. I'll tell you who's in it, y'all. It's School Bus versus SQ. Oh, my God. It's Round with all Mirror. A mirror. <laughs> Gonna be a lot of stand slash and jump slash. A lot of it. Okay, I'll let you hold on. I'll let you know. Let me just jump on. Spectate. And now I'm good. I'm in there. Alright, so school buzz versus SQ. Loser semifinals is three out of five. Who which Ramlethal is hotter today? That's what Fuck it comes down to. Who's who's feeling good in the mirror match? That's what this is gonna tell us tonight. True. I mean it's been a long day, so it's some people, you know, long sets. They get powered up, and some people, you know, they have a limit too. So I'm excited to see. Like this has been such the trek through the the bracket. I could see SQ so powered up through losers right now. Who knows? We'll see how it's gonna play out. Again, all the top eight is getting paid out tonight. Thank you for your astronomical support, chat. Y'all have been amazing in helping the players today with your subs, your gift subs, and your direct contributions to the prize pool. Uh, while they get started, a big thank you to Katamari. Thank you, Zach and ECT. Homies, thank you for the $200. Yeah, I'm ready when they're ready. My bad. I'm ready whenever they like to begin. Uh, thank you also, PK Jamu. Thanks for your big $100. Thank you, Punk the God, who also gave $100 for the tournament. Thank you, The Visualizer. Thank you, thank you Wish Crab, Rose Breyer, Mika Chu, and Scort Wandler. Those were just the top donors. Everyone gave at least $50 from everybody that I mentioned. That's amazing, chat. Thanks for all the support. Let's get into it. Hopefully, uh, Punk can make it next time, but I'm glad Panda Pink's holding it down. Yeah, yeah, P Pink's taking care of it, so, you know, it's all good. Yeah. Here we go. The sides are correct now, chat. SQ is player one, and player two is school bus. Let me get the colors. That will help. 
Ooh. His air slash, he's got to watch out. I really like, like the green Ramathal color. It looks like that's SQ in the green color, and School Bus yep. is the yellow Ramlethal. Hopefully that helps everyone at home. So Ram Mirror, deal with oh, your own nonsense. Ooh. That's the matchup. First right out. Okay. Big combo Get for this. Hit. Okay. Mm -hmm. With the armless. Jump heavy, nice block. Wow, super. great super. Jin show me. Smart. The OTG was not enough, but School Bus has a nice lead. Counter hit, jump S. Oh my god, that's a wall combo. That's a wall combo. No burst available. This is a super. Close. Yo. So close. Okay. And hard knockdown. Are they going to. Oh my, was that safe? You have safe meaty down punches? Oh my it goodness. Oh. The, range, the range was too big. Good job, School no Bus. Fear. In time. I learned a lot in that first round. She has safe meaty post goal break? <laughs> right down to the post goal. Here comes the pressure. Keep them down. Really good, here. good opportunity with the damage wall break and positive here do the block string yeah oh, can't AI. really do much oh my when when are you supposed to press a button when are you allowed to do something <laughs> you're supposed to os throw tech with fd so they go low vic come on oh okay i see all right wow what a goal burst I need my three defensive OS's on deck and some meter. Then I can get a pass. <laughs> true, true, true. Minus 19. You must take the mix. Oh, oh my. When are, you, when are you supposed to press a button? Not there. Not there, apparently. There were, those were all the lows. <laughs> that was checking <laughs> the throw tech OS. So there you go. There's the mix. <laughs> Finally. Okay, school bus. Now. I must oppress you, all right? Goal burst denied. The same situation. Oh, my yep. God. This is cheap. Yeah. <laughs> Look at the risk. That's cute. What Even a, a jab is a guaranteed counter hit. No, it's not a throw. Oh, Sorry. Yeah. Don't try to tag. Even if it was too far. All right. One Solid. to zero for SQ. Top four. So what wow. was top four? Two Ramlethals. Soul. And what was the last character? Ram. May. May, right? Oh, two May, May, sorry. Yeah, two round of thoughts, Soul and May. That was top four. <laughs> Ooh. I mean, that's, I mean, that sounds like a upper echelon characters, you know? That sounds like a bunch of people that want to win. <laughs> <laughs> Picking some good characters, good options. Dual one. This is how we're going to learn, okay? They're going to play extra cheap, all right? As cheap as possible. That's how we're going to get better, because we're going to learn how to deal with this. Minus 19, you must deal with it. I guess I should explain that. So when you air block and you land from air block chat, uh, you have a special recovery animation. During that animation, for 19 frames, you can do nothing but block. Nothing else is allowed, not even a super. Ooh, all this pressure. Without the meter, it's like, do you want to spend the burst? And with the follow-up explosion, is that worth it? Yeah, <laughs> if I don't he doesn't even know. hit it? You have to come back that round if you spend the burst here. That's the scary part. Oh my goodness. When are you supposed to play the game? Oh. Fine. Nope. Nope. You still can't play. And the risk nope. is maxed. <laughs> oh my goodness. Perfect. That was nice. That was a very long perfect. They're teaching each other the power <laughs> of their own character right now. Slash heavy into the cat scratch. That's the power of the mirror. Sometimes it's a 10 0, sometimes a 5 5. Sometimes, yep, it just depends. Either way, you're, you're teaching each other when you fight this type of matchup, especially at this level. <laughs> Best believe that if School Bus loses this, the tech is stolen the next time. All the tech. Ooh. No RC, saving the meter. Counter Runs hit. Right out, but the caught. No combo conversion. But we have a lot of plus frames off the red cancel. That's a combo. First save. Jump H. That's a big. Reminds me of biking so much, but it's like even better in my place. 
Yeah, it's really good for crossing up and escaping the corner, right? Just a great button. You can, uh, you can early uh, ID it and try to get a throw, but you know, she can, she has shin shows. The hurt box is great too. If you've seen in a hurt box viewer chat, the hurt box is the whole sword. So even the top of the sword can hit you if you try to get a buffer or something like that. Really great move to jump heavy. Right cancel to the, ooh, no throws today. No throws today. Up Roman cancel I, I like, for the extended follow up. I like that. The up RC extension. School bus has been using that a lot today to push them at a height where the follow up is harder to burst out from. Go burst from SQ. No, no comeback. Nah. No comeback to the tie set. Dorga! Wow, one to one. One to one. It's a tie set. We'll see who's feeling stronger tonight. They both have their own semblance of tech. We can see that SQ has extremely oppressive corner mix and corner combos, but Scoobus has some of their own tech, including the up Roman cancel to extend combos, get the damage to be even better. Any position. Damn. Man, dual one. Here we go. Game three. Cross up, jump heavy. SH, S, S, Swords, good dash out, I like that dash out. Yep. 6P, good Ooh. one, and that's hard knockdown. Go first, regular first, excuse me. Azul. She is on a tear here, getting dash started, the explosion. Uh -oh. She's partying. Another throw. Oh, it was too far, but it was also too far to punish. Right, it was a couple pixels away then. Here comes the pressure. Oh, oh my no. goodness. <laughs> no, you thought it was your turn. You thought it was your turn to play the game, School Bus, but it was not. It was a trick. There was one fake out there, but no. <laughs> I like the wait out, but just runs up, takes a turn. Oh, nice. Gets the counter hit turn. So just a little bit pass. close to the corner. But it doesn't matter. Still gets the hit. Ouch. Hard knockdown mix from SQ. What we got? Ooh, that was nasty. That was a throw bait, huh? Oh, nice there. Oh, nice there. RC. RC conversion. And the burst did oh, not work. Burst. Too and high. That up. answered the question from last game. Would they burst into the explosion? No. At that height? Not. Most definitely. Not. <laughs> they're going to burst and they're going to die, is what's going to happen. Burst. Oh, no. Oh, no. The gems are blasted everywhere. Yes, yes. People are picking them up. Oof, yeah, two one right got now. The set play right now. I agree. They both have really strong pressure, but uh, the set play of SQ in the corner is—it's not that it's unblockable. It's more like it's unescapable right now. Very hard for School Bus to get away. Her call out anti airs that whole last round, immaculate. Definitely change it up mm -hmm. very well. Oof. All right, dual one. Match number four. These mirrors are intense. <laughs> oh. Slash heavy. Oh, no. Got around the overhead. High juggle. Ooh, that's trying to get this, this turn going. That's right. Excellent start. Cat scratch. Seems like that's risky for her to try to punish. Purple cancel pressure. Hey. You know, School Bus has a lot of meter. Good block. Was, that was a good block. Purple cancel to steal, the, steal their turn. Can't finish it without meter. Too dangerous. Counter hit, jump S. That is a burst. So no more burst for either player. Purple chase down did not work. Got the bounce. Uh, that was clutch. Very clutch combo. Good SQ. combo. Jump heavy denied by the six punch of SQ. She's been super on point now with those. It's hard for School Bus to get any momentum started because of that too. A lot of the approaches of School Bus have been denied by the 6P, the fadeaway jump S, and the slash heavy. The basic strings. Jump punch Aye. too, like you saw. Fadeaway jump S again. I'm, you know, I could be wrong. I'm pretty sure that a school bus smashes a S there on that fadeaway that they can get the hit. Oh, might be too late. What a lead here. It might be too late. 
it might be too late. See what we'll Schoolbus can do. Oh no, the back dash and falls right into the stand slash. A perfect, yeah. And Puppy. looking good here. Going into losers finals. SQ, wow. So SQ is guaranteed top three, everybody. Three to one. Give it up at home for School Bus Child, who's also fought extremely well with their Rambler Thor and had their own unique tech alongside what SQ was showing us. So give it up to them. Four plates tonight for you, School Bus. We'll make sure you get hooked up from that prize pool. They have given 50 gift subs in the channel. Woo! So we're going to go straight to the next one, everybody. Let's keep it going because y'all have been here patiently enjoying all the great matches. Loser's final coming up. And in this one, it's going to be SQ. She's sticking around. And she will be up against... Someone else really strong. Who is it? Let me look at the bracket one more time. Ferno. <laughs> Props Ferno. So Ferno with the May versus SQ with the Ramblethal. It's losers finals in just a moment. Once the players set up, I'm gonna spectate and we're gonna go straight into it, everybody. Understood. So SQ needs a moment. That gives me a chance to say thank you, everybody that's been supporting us tonight with your your subs, your gift subs, your donations, and everything else. As you can see, the prize pool page is over fifteen hundred dollars thanks to you. It's a guaranteed top eight payout. Yeah, thank You've given you. excellent support to Henry. Said at next level two, it's great, fellas. But the crowdfund is not over just yet. You can still help out with all your subs and gift subs. I'll add some more money for them at the end. And yeah, you can find SQ here on Twitch. Her Twitch channel is Squirrel. Shoot, I forget the numbers. I gotta go look it up right now. There you go. Thank you, Curly. We can do this too. Shout out. Let's see how to do this. Uh, squirrel 147. I keep wanting to say Squirrel 187. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. There's her channel. Shouts you to Eureka 187. <laughs> cool. So we're, we, okay, once SQ is all set, we're going to jump back into this one. You have the match you know, information in the chat, everybody. If you want to help out and support, of course, everything you do for us always helps us keep blowing it up bigger and doing what we do. So thanks for that, y'all. Yeah, thank you, everybody. The community has been coming together so strong and especially seeing so many people from so many different games playing this <laughs> hardcore. You know, I appreciate y'all. Thank you. Cool. I think that they're about ready because I see them setting up. So I'm going to jump into it. Uh, SQ on the player one. Ferno, I believe, is going to be player two. It's losers final, so still three out of five. Uh, thank you, Matt Beats, for the sub. Y'all started another hype train. This is the third hype train of the day, chat. That's crazy. And uh, we're considering a PlayStation tournament next week. We'll see. I'm ready whenever the players are ready. They look like they're ready, too. So cool. Great. Let's do it, everybody. Losers Finals. My name is Spooky. I'm joined by Lord Nerd Josh. You can also follow them here on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Nerd Josh. Thank you, Josh, for jumping hey. in with us. Hope hey, you also no had fun at the ECT event. Now we got SQ versus Ferno. All the top eight got paid out again, or will get paid out thanks to your, your humongous support, everybody. Y'all are godlike. There was a cap, wow, wow, the cap was 128. We were afraid of managing a larger tournament. We wanted to make sure that everybody had a good experience. Cool. It, it, it is running really quickly. I'm glad that I tested all the spectating stuff and that I had backup plans because this kind of also worked. This worked pretty well. Most matchups in this game go fast. There's a few that don't, but... Uh... Ooh, no, this, 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 like, this as is. We say that. Look, the perfect right here. This is an attacking this, this game, game, Nerd Josh. This is a game yeah. where you attack the other person. Okay, run away. No. To be honest, like this might offend some people, but it, it, this game does give me VSAB vibes on how defense is way harder than offense. That's what I'm saying. No, started. this is an attacking game. Okay, that's how it is. Yeah. To be defensive is hard. You have to 6P at the right time. You have the yellow cancel wall. You have to backdash and not have your backdash get hit. Defense is harder than offense. That's the game. Ooh. Let's get key. I run up roll. Is that pressure? Oh, DRC? what is that, yeah, Bix? <laughs> right out. The block. Though. Greatest I game, mean, that, that Greatest game. Ridiculous. Agree. But I think most players now they see a BRC, they're like, oh, I might have to block two overheads. That's exactly. And then you get by the low. It's just hard knockdown. You're like, oh, okay. Did that meter again? At least with some characters, you get that big damage though. I don't know, man. Take, taking a down dust in blue cancel, that's pretty risky. They get combos there. You're in slow motion. Oh, no. But some characters, yeah. 
<laughs> or getting that 2K, the close slash, but already yep, taking yep. that game one. SQ. Even with all the ways Ferno escaped the corner there and was crafty, you know, man, such explosive gameplay from SQ's Ram. She is on a tear. The, the blood is in the water right now. No doubt, no doubt. <laughs> the oh. sharks are out for this match of Reno money. I hear y'all. Let's do a fun one. We got a fun prediction for y'all, everybody. Hope y'all enjoy it. Read the prediction well. Don't don't pick the wrong option and be sad. <laughs> Ooh, throw baits! We have throw baits in our box strings. <laughs> oh, getting hit near the quarter. Unfortunate. All that damage. Positive bonus. Counter this. Wow. Waited for the I dolphin. Think that's a super, got right? that's a super. Oh yeah. my god, actually they dropped the super no. input. They dropped the super input. They just go Plus for frames. the block string here, it's all positive. Gonna still build meter. Ooh, YRC, nice, but... The the hard thing here for Ferno is they're not gonna gain any meter for the next 5-6 seconds, so... Definitely gonna have to get out of this pressure with the and burst that or... Risk, that risk is way too high. Oh, counter, counter. Oh, okay, never mind. Regular throw, keeping it as safe Wait as possible. Out. And blue cancel. Oh Aye. my god, the smartest of escapes. I'm escaping yeah, as safely BRC. as I can. Jump slash. Not much you could do there. Ooh, what an anti air. Going to the corner? No, not yet. But here we are now. Fade away jump S into mix. Tots get key. Oh my Super. goodness. How, how do you get offense? How are you supposed to attack? I think Inferno's thinking the same thing. He's like, how do, how do I attack? <laughs> what am I supposed to do? <laughs> you swing the anchor back. <laughs> I mean, they That's have right. an anchor, but SQ has two swords. True. Look at that. Oh, no. <laughs> Unfortunate. And then any chip here. Oh, my goodness. We'll go to the four Scalza. punch just to be played safe. That's nice. Two to zero right now. But you know, Ferno fought really strong to get to this point. Just know, y'all, that Ferno was in winner's bracket all the way until winner's finals. So if they have a reserve power, Chad, now is the time where it's going to come out. If they have some Latin power, something that's hiding in there, <laughs> like it or not, it's definitely going to appear right now in this moment. I mean, we've seen we've seen the three-game comebacks plenty of times. But Oh, yeah. When you're back into the how wall... how close have this been... Mm -hmm. Especially yeah. in an early tournament like this, when you're back into the wall, things come out of you that you don't even realize you can do them sometimes. That's what happens in this situation. You want to win so bad that you just try to do things that you never tried before. Like, I feel like May can still scramble it up, but SQ's been just doing such a great job in minimizing so many of these situations and being at the right range to react. Oh, this block sure, yes! And that was a combo, my goodness. Positive bonus. Oh. This is it. This is this is it for Ferno. This is the last moment. Put it all on the table. Whatever you got. She Counter hit job. Sweep? Mm -hmm. How many of those sweeps are hers? I came into this late. I don't know. I don't know. She didn't play on the stream very often, to be honest. I wouldn't be surprised if in the okay. pools it was a litany no of bodies doesn't. everywhere. <laughs> In this game, I, I can imagine, given the correct matchup. Counsel. Oh. Venus. Low. Oh my. Block string painting off. Maybe Ferno's trying to get a reversal super through and it's still plus or something, or just can't get it. I don't know. I'm not sure. I think that that off that offense that SQ has, there's something. There's another layer yes. there that people are not ready for, even amongst the standard round of throw pressure. Blue cancel. No, you oh, can't get away. Swing back. You cannot get away with so, the Totsuki key. She was just so prepared for this, honestly. The, the, like, how many people I've seen fight Mei and, you know, have to remind themselves what to do? She already knew where to place herself. Counter hit most Totsugekis that came in and got huge damage and was already aware of how Mei wanted to escape the corner. That was just, you know, that was just incredibly solid. <laughs> 
All right, everybody, we're going to start for the grand finals momentarily. Give it up to Ferno, everybody, who gets a strong third place finish tonight with their May. They win winner's bracket the entire tournament until winner's finals. That's a strong performance and a strong showing. They'll be getting a nice third place piece of the prize pool tonight. And I hope to see more of you very soon, Ferno. Keep it up. Now we're going to get ready for the grand finals of the first set in just a moment. Oh, I'm still spectating. Perfect. That works great. I want you to tell me that was three to zero. Yes, for SQ in the loser's final. Sure, understood. So SQ is going to take a moment for a breather. In the meantime, I want you to tell me who you think is going to win set number one. All right, you're going to have two minutes to bet it as of right now. Your choices are uh, SQ resets the bracket. All right, how about that? Resets the bracket. Here you go. You got two minutes to bet it. So your choices are. You can choose whether you think SQ is going to reset the bracket. If you're choosing no, then that means that you think that Pink will win the entire tournament in only one set of three out of five grand finals. Ooh, today was intense shot. I'm, I'm biding my time and getting ready for that next match. It's your last chance to help out the Match Arena crowdfund too if you would like to. Thanks to all of you at home. We received over $1,500. We appreciate it. Jump in the page if you like and help out. You can use the goodies on the sidebar as always. You can donate directly. You can buy a shirt or you can give us subs, your gift subs and your prime subs. Any type of support will help us out tonight. Thanks to all of you. We've already contributed $400 just from subscriptions, but we're hoping to add even Yo. more. Thanks from you guys at home. We appreciate it. Thank you. All right. Once everybody's ready, we're going to begin the grand finals. I'm already spectating for the first set of grants. And once again, as a reminder, the matchup is going to be SQ. She's coming from the winner side of the bracket. She'll be up against Pink, representing Panda Global. Panda Global's Pink. Sorry, SQ is coming from the loser side. I said the winner side. Pink is the one that's coming from winners. Good job, Pink, for staying winners the entire tournament. Hard tournament. 128 Guilty Gear players, and many of them I have a lot of respect for. I've seen what they can do in this game. So, Pink, if you can be top two at this one, thumbs up. Seriously, really strong. Yeah, no. I mean, Pink isn't just a Street Fighter V player. Uh, Pink's been playing a long time since 4, Marvel, all that. Like I said earlier, you know, was strong in BB Tag, strong in other games. SQ just legacy anime. So, you know, you do get this Capcom slash anime clash here, but I, I Pink is, uh, you know, Mankind plays everything. So, you know, I don't think it's necessarily fair to say Duel Pink plays one. Capcom games. No, I mean, I would see Pink as a, a strong Capcom competitor because I see them as a player that has yeah. like a footsie style, right? But no, you're right in yep. that Pink can play a lot of different games and is really good at anything that he puts his mind to. I agree. Great throw off the jump S. Jump heavy mix. Good sweep. Good sweep and gets the burst. Yeah, offensive burst denied. That was great awareness by SQ. 5k on wake up that was smart that's the anti uppercut tech you do the 5k three frames if they're point blank yeah and the strong thing about that is you have a five frame window to, that, that your throw in, invulnerable nice super to clutch but you know it takes five frames to the run up grab somebody after they get yes, up, so after they get up so and you can't really mess with them you can no, just no. kind of mix between stand kick and, and dp as long as you get close that's right. You straight up do not have enough frames to grab the stand kick. That's how wake up works in this game. Vortex fake. Ooh, doubt. Man, these backwards RC fake outs, I love this. They're baiting everything possible. Good jump out. Counter hit. Confirm. Oh. RC. Nice. Damage. One round apiece. That's heavy. Forward as from... Yeah. The really good forward us from Pink. Did not get the full combo. That moves a fortress. But so is Stan Slash from Ram. Ooh. I mean, yeah, pretty much. The party, the party starters for SQ are the Stan Slash, the Fadeaway Slash, and I guess the Jump Heavy. Those are her party starters. Oh, was that a, was that a bait? We have oh. wall mix-ups? Confirmed. Good back oh, dash. Broke up the plus. Josh, this is really hype right hey. now. They're doing some high-level stuff. Slash? Nice run of grab. Oh, oh the took PRC. the first! That was Yo, godlike. the run of grab again! That was godlike. Wow, pink! Solid. I mean, 
is is i feel like this is going to be a close one you know i, I but we'll see we'll see how it plays out whoa that was sick right just King, that's only number neutral. one that's only number one sq you know, is it a stand about... slash is it stand slash is it forward slash is it run up grab i i don't, I don't know i'm know. scared he has other options too he starts <laughs> doing stuff like the late bandit revolver to catch your timing so he'll do like forward slash wait bandit revolver if you try to backdash it actually hits you he gets a combo for those oh trust he be smooth mm -hmm. see there it is speaking Aye. of which and when it hits late like Aye. that it's harder to punish it it's not like when it hits point blank <laughs> it's more of a movement option than an yeah attack then a, then the thing you can punish yeah i know Go burst. A lot of meter available for SQ now. Oh, oh she's going to spend bomb. Good burst. Good burst. Still, the same situation. Counters all around. Wake up super. RC. No side switch combo. Just going for the other corner. No way, oh, right? Does it. Yeah, the put oh, okay. RC time. Back Backdash. Good one. Slash heavy. Oh, good break. Good break. It wasn't a good punish with the forward there slash. There is, there is. Wow. Wow. Pink is making some godlike choices. Really good yeah. offense. Ooh, the run up. Count hit us. Oh, gets the counter hit. Big combo for this. Damn it. That is a wall break. Believe that. You see a sword <laughs> explode on the wall. GG. The stand punch wall break. Tetanus scratch. Oh, swing back. Great break. Slash. Good confirm. Side switch time. It's a mix too. You can't oh. jump out there. Good. Wow. What reactions? Yellow cancel. Trying to escape. Good down dust. Pink situation. We're off the game after the yellow cancel. That was a great down dust, but SQ with the defense. Defense. Yes, same kick. With no fear. Ambitious play around the corner. Oh. The clip though. And Punk trying to get that stand slash, but Italian right back. It's Q. I see that SQ's making an adjustment though. Instead of the fadeaway jump S, she's leaning a lot more on the stand your ground, the standing S. Mm. We'll see oh, if it works. Faster. 6P, Plus confirm. A bajillion. What a throw tech. My turn. Side switch. And I have the burst. I can be offensive now. Wall break. Mm. Vortex. It's a purple cancel. Oh, the air to air punch. Ooh, the range. Oh, we got a mix. We got a mix. Nice dust. Yeah. That was hard to see in all the explosions that were going on. Tie score, everybody. One to one. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. This is what I came to see, chat. You know, I'm I'm not biased right now. I just want to see it go to the very last round, honestly. <laughs> I don't know what's going to happen. Honestly, I can't tell who's better right now. You know, sometimes you can watch two players play, and especially when the game is new, it's clear when one person has a higher level than the other player. That's just how it goes, right? This one, I don't know. I'm not sure who's better. They're both sick. I mean, the game's still new, you know? People are just grinding, you know? We're not even at, like, the first month point, you know? Take your time, everybody. Success. Wow, good choice. The walk back down dust. OTG mix for SQ. Respecting the uppercuts oh. as well. Really good timing. Super. It's party time. Oh, Chiro. Wow. Volcanic Viper. Ooh. Patient stuff. Another throw. Now bit. what? Will we reversal? We will not reversal. Good escape with the blue cancel. Punk tried to Ooh, cancel it out with the purple. With nope. Oh. The sword was still recovering, I think, is what happened there. No punish there. Get the air to air. Still living, somehow. Pixels, though. I don't even think that they can take slash heavy anymore. Gun flame. Ooh, Ooh no. Nope. swung the mine. Okay. Couldn't even take the slash heavy. Slash. All right. The positioning looked good in the corner, but no. Nice. Aye. And the backdash on the stand kick. Didn't make much of it, but, you know. Just 
still holding the ground. Has that corner position here. And will break. Aye. Opa. Break that glass. Bandit revolver. Wow. You can grab that if he gets too close. <laughs> Today I learned. Danger. That was too dangerous. That's a full the punish. You throw. Ooh. Big punish. How into the vortex. Whoa. Godlike. Godlike All combo. Back dash. Yo. His counter hits into Vortex, by the way, have been top notch. He has a lot of counter specific Vortex setups, and it really makes his damage much higher than it could be otherwise. Ball pressure, but Yank Ready Kerr gets the punish. Throw. The slash, yes, but the burst back. She's going to take her chance here, gets the slash. Slash heavy. Uh oh. Oh, the 5K was Ooh. too. Even the 5 frame 5K was too fast. Purple cancel. Forced to trade. <laughs> Counter hit slash. Almost, almost. She tried to freestyle a purple combo from it. Oh no, the gun flame. Right into it. And the air conversion, keeping it simple. Slash yeah, that slash pink. Good stuff, pink. Two so to pink one. right now, two to one lead. SQ had some signs of life that last round though with the purple cancel confirm it up. That just just slightly did not go her way. We'll see how this next one goes. Where? First hit three frames, second hit five frames. So when they do a max range like that, it's not a three frame standing kick anymore. It becomes like five frames or something. It's still fast. It's about as fast as most characters standing punch at that point. Not over yet, everybody. No. Woo. We, we might still even have one more set. We never know. We don't know. It, anything can happen. It is only three out of five in the grand finals, everybody. Just so you know, it is only three of five. I think it's so playing SQ, good though. SQ must win two games. Pink only needs one. Ooh, throw. Nice. Good super. The super. Ow. Okay, what up, grab? No fear. Gets out of that stand slash range, but the RC pressure. Keeping it on here. Gets the stand kick. The forward slash burst out. Yes. Wow, the far slash actually has about the same. It, does it have more range than her far slash? Is that possible? Y actually, if you look at the hitbox, you'll you'll. He gasp. has more range than her, it's, huh? It's, it's literally a fortress. That's crazy. I don't. It might not actually have more range. We can try to. It's, it's, it looks close. That, at the least, it's close to equal. He has almost the same range of her far slash. That's really beneficial. Definitely another obnoxious hitbox. <laughs> Ooh, back dash, Jimmy. Gets called out by the stand slash to RC. Good, Ooh, good the confirm. Media, okay. Oh, that's a full combo, too. Going to conversion. With the arm. No arm. He's out of there. Now what? SQ with the patient. Success. Full combo. She got a burst back. Was that a burst bait? I wonder about that. The blocks. Tamare. Oh, that was his. He's freestyling pressure and it's work and took the gold first. Oh. Pink. <laughs> it's over. Yo, Pink. I mean, it's such Dang. explosive gameplay. I, how many times? -like. They punished the gold first. The reads, That's hard. <laughs> the reads on the neutral, the stand slashes, the throws, you know, Pink was just blowing it up all day, honestly. Sure. Man. That, that was some good games, though. I think SQ, she did really well. And Pink, you know, just held it down, honestly. Kept it kept it strong from winners and, you know, got that first set. Chat, that was beastly. Seriously, they played so great the entire tournament. In the top eight, we saw a lot of different play styles and a lot of strong stuff. In the end, Pink. Really showing their tournament prowess and how strong they can be in tournament, taking the first place. SQ, no joke, to say the least. Really making Ramlethal look I'm extra cheap. All. Let's take a look at everything together, chat. Y'all can see all the top eight and how it played out at the end. That was so fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it at home, everybody. Whew.
All right, so here you go. This was the final placings and how it all played out, everybody. First place was Pandas Pink, 3-2-1 in the first set of grand finals. Second place was SQ with the amazing Ramlethal. First place was Ferno, Ferno May. Watch out for Ferno, everybody. Fourth place, School Bus, also Ramlethal. Uh, fifth place tie, we had Kizzy K as Kai and Diaphone as Eno. That's what I'm talking about. And seventh place tie, we had Rakir who plays Chip and we had Glacio Rain who plays Leo. Really good mix of characters in the top eight. Two Ramlethos. Everything else are pretty good mix, I think. A nice variety of different yeah. characters in the top eight. I mean, usually in the top eight, you have at least two of the same characters. So I, I think like that's a that. pretty so, good variety for this week. I think so, too. That was really hype shot. What did you guys think at home? Let us know, everybody, if you enjoyed it. We are going to come back next week with one for you soon. And we'll make sure to have uh, to have the sign-ups page up for you soon, too, so that you can join us. PlayStation next week, confirmed. So next week is PS4 slash PS5. We'll come back to PC in two weeks, everybody. So PC lovers, if you love the PC version, don't worry, we got y'all. We'll be back in two weeks, but you can still play with us if you have the game on PS4 or PS5 next week. Thanks oh, for yeah, all the subs you gave up. us tonight, too. Yes, please. Thanks for all the subs, all the gift subs, and everything else you gave us. The total amount of subscribers of Team Spooky, let's see what we got in the end. Y'all gave me a lot. 227. Is that right? 227 subs? Damn. Ask the stream for what? Does anybody know if the homie Ferno, who played so well tonight, does anybody know if Ferno has a Twitter? They left before we could make a results post. If anybody knows them well, let us know. That was great. I agree. That was so fun. Thanks for all the subs once again. A total matcherino. How much did I add from you at home? Because I'm going to add a little more. I want to spice it up. I added in total 250, or I can add a little more than that. I'm going to add another, I don't know. I'll give them like another 100 bucks or something, right? Why not? courtesy of you all at home thanks for all the subs and gift subs i also got to make sure all the staff gets paid and all that good stuff so thanks everybody for helping out hey. i appreciate y'all that was godlike today chat i don't even know what to say some of the best matches i'm glad that you got to jump in at the end josh that hey no problem I, I wish i could have got in earlier <laughs> no you're kidding you came i think you came at kind of the right time it was fun for me to talk for myself for a while about the players and everything else but i think you came more or less at the right time to make it extra hype yeah, PlayStation, there was some hype finals too. Uh, yeah, definitely check that out. <laughs> no doubt, no doubt. So Got that here, Leo Potemkin action. Here's what I was thinking from here, chat. We also have uh, we also have the Arturo tournament going on right now on his stream, I believe. So I was thinking I was just going to go spectate some of that and check that out too. So if y'all want to see more Guilty Gear, guys, don't go far because we got even more Guilty Gear action that we can spectate. And you can also check out their tournament and see how it's going to go. So check that one out if y'all want to see it. Uh, what else? Uh, support Lord Nerd Josh. If you had fun tonight, everybody, you can check them out here on Twitch uh, at Nerd Josh. You can also check out some of your favorite players here on Twitch too. So let me give you some of the links. Uh, you guys also a Squirrel's channel, but one more time, it's Squirrel147. We also got Pink the God that you can check out. Shout out Pink. What is it? Punk the God. I believe it's their channel here on Twitch. Punk the God. Give them a follow if you enjoyed their amazing gameplay tonight. And there were many more. So don't be afraid. If you played in our tournament today and you're listening in right now, uh, don't be afraid to come in our channel right now and tell everybody to follow your stream and follow what you do in Guilty Gear. Oh, yeah. Long. Woo, that was really hype, Josh. I know I'm saying it over and over, but no. seriously, that was crazy. No, Thank honestly, you. I love this first month hype of a new game. You know, it's, everyone's not completely 100% yet, so it can go up and down so quick, you know. That was but this so is how fun. you get good. It is how you get good. You learn a lot really quickly. I saw a lot of new combos. I saw a lot of new technology and a lot of different stuff. By the way, Ferno's Twitter, Curly had it. I gave it to you just now in the chat. Cool. All right, guys. So that's the end of the recording, but I'm not done streaming.